Hey, Brian from Spoon Direct here. Just want to take a few minutes and uh, show you how to set up uh, set up our all black ink system for the Epson 1400. So the first thing you want to do is uh, hit the ink button. That'll move the carriage to the, to the middle there, so you can get the ink, all the ink cartridges out. It comes with four ounces of all black dye based ink, a special syringe and needle, and six pre filled um, refillable cartridges. So, the first thing you want to do is um, go ahead and take a look at these clear, these are, these are the vent plugs on the top of these cartridges. All these, all these clear uh, plugs need to come out before you install it in the printer. All the cartridges are colored with um, the corresponding color in the printer, so just go ahead and put them in the right slot. Hit the ink button, and it'll, it'll cycle back to the home position. Let's say you want to refill the cartridge, just go ahead and hit the ink button again. That'll move the cartridge to the center, the carriage to the center. As you'll see, these ink cartridges are clear, so you'll be able to easily monitor the ink level in them. They have auto reset chips so that Every time you turn the printer on and off, or pull the cartridge out and put it back in, it resets these chips to full. So you, there's no need for a chip resetter. To fill the cartridge, what you're going to do is pull it out of the printer. And you're going to want to get some latex gloves. Open your black ink. Draw about 10 cc's of ink into the syringe. Go ahead and pull the colored plug out of the cartridge. That's the fill plug. And then insert the blunt tip needle into the cartridge and slowly depress the ink. And you can watch the ink level rise in the cartridge until it gets to about three quarters full. Now I'd like to take a minute and demonstrate our recommended settings for use with our all black ink system in Accurate. Okay, the first thing you're going to want to do is choose your printer model from the drop down menu. Second thing you're going to do is choose the paper size or roll size. And then go ahead and click on the multi black feature. Choose standard ink. Make sure all the colors are checked. Uh, print resolution, leave it to 1440 720 medium. Here you can choose the dot type, frequency, and angle. 22 and a half degrees and 45 LPI are the default settings. I'd leave them right there to begin with. You can change them later if you want to do a smaller dot. Now you can go ahead and do a test print. Go to File, Setup, and then to your test print option and see how it prints. Thanks for taking the time to watch your tutorial. If you have any questions on this video, please email us at info at filmdirectonline.com. And when you get a chance, check out our website, www.filmdirectonline.com. Thanks.